It has been said, consciousness is universal. This is not as far-fetched as it sounds. If conscious awareness is based on the same creative process that gave us the potential for the interconnected nature of the World Wide Web with the wonders of modern electronics, then conscious awareness could be explained as the most advanced part of a universal creative process using the logic of physics just as we use physics to explain electronics. If physics is the most fundamental science, then we should be able to explain everything as a physical process using physics. It should even be possible to explain conscious awareness and free will as a physical process. By explaining conscious awareness in its most simple form as electrical activity in the brain that is aware of its own electrical potential, this theory can explain consciousness as the most advanced part of one universal process. We have electrical activity relative to the structure of the brain forming chemical changes or chemical reactions. Chemical energy is stored in the bonds that hold the atoms together. As the bonds form and break, we have the continuous exchange of photon energy with the future unfolding relative to the electrical activity and the structure of the brain. This is a totally universal process. The future is always unfolding with electrical activity relative to the structure of the atoms and the wavelength of the light. Life is an integral part of creation with the flow of time as a process of continuous energy exchange and our consciousness as a continuous stream of unbroken, ever-changing flow of ideas, feelings, dreams, hopes and emotions being part of the same universal process. Many people have said on YouTube that everything is consciousness and in a way I do not disagree with them in the sense that consciousness is the most advanced part of a universal process that everything is based upon. In this theory we can have individuality based on the non-duality of one universal process but we lose an important aspect of reality that can make everything logical if we just say everything is consciousness and then not try and explain how we can have the duality of individuality based on non-duality. In such a theory the oneness that the mystic feels in meditation is based on the same process that forms the unity of physics and mathematics. Thanks for watching. Please share and subscribe. It will help the promotion of this theory.